You can move, rotate, and mirror stitches in cross stitch. You can also erase stitches and change the colors and the stitch types. But before you edit stitches, just like an embroidery canvas, you have to select the object first. So in this video, we're going to learn about different ways to select in cross stitch. Let's first look at the Select Object tool. I'm going to zoom in because the Select Object tool I'm going to use to select just these top three stitches. And I can click and drag a bounding box around the stitches, and I now have them selected. So I could change the color. I could change the type of stitch. I could copy. I could cut. I'll press Escape to get rid of that tool and go back to view the entire design. And we'll look at Polygon Select. Polygon Select is good for selecting an area that is irregular shape. So I'm going to zoom in. In this case, we're going to select just this part of the butterfly. So I'll select Polygon Select and then use clicks around the object and press Enter, and it will select the stitches within the area. Now, unlike our Polygon Select in Embroidery Canvas, this will select any stitches that are enclosed in the area. So you have to be careful about not getting too wide in this area. So I would have to escape and do that over if I just wanted the body of the stitch. There's a better way to select just this color, and that is Auto Select. Auto Select will select a block of stitches of the same color. The stitches have to touch. So this is an easy way to select by color in cross stitch. I could also use it to select the purple wing because all those stitches touch. If you want to select multiple items, you would hold down the control key and then you can select actually all the purple wings. You can also lock stitches and outlines so that they are not moved accidentally. Go to the edit menu and at the very bottom, you'll find outlines and crosses. These are both checked, which means that they would be able to be moved. If I uncheck them, I cannot move the cross stitches. Uh, I will still be able to select them, but I will not be able to move the stitches. 